What's happening guys, Palmer here. Um, this is a tutorial and as you guys have probably seen, um, in my building process of my new gaming computer or the um, changing of the case, I got new RAM. So let me just take the side panel off for you guys. I got some RAM. Now this is G-Skill RAM. They're very sexy RAM modules. Um, very high performance, but the problem is I've only had three channels, okay? Which means I can still have 12 gig, just it looks very, very ugly missing a channel. So, luckily today, when I went and picked myself up those 2.1 um, Logitech Z623 uh, speaker system, I got some USBs, two USBs, 16 gig, and I also picked myself up some G-Skill memory. <laughs> so, what a coincidence. Um, this is two, which is eight gig, so four each, um, which is in a way good for that. And also, if one RAM module decides to fail, I'll have an extra. So as you can see, they're very, very sexy. So I'm going to go into the unboxing portion of this actual video. So I'm going to lay down the camera. Not going to be the best, but anyway. So we're going to grab here, right, and open. So you get your usual G Skill sticker. The back plate, and then you get your two RAM modules. Okay, so if I seems like it's gonna break, let me put it down and take the RAM modules out. Christopher, shut up! For fuck's, for fuck's sake, lad. Okay, so there's one of them. There's two of them. And this is DDR3, guys, so yeah. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull out another RAM module that I previously had. So, I'm going to set one aside just so I know which one's which. And then I'm going to go and pull a RAM module out, okay? So, what you're going to want to do is, obviously, de-static yourself, okay? You're not going to be able to see, but I can set it up somewhere. Chris, come here! Chris! Can you help me, please? Let's record this video quickly. Alright, so what you're going to do is just hold it so you, so you guys can see me like that. Just hold it right there. Okay? So, what you're going to want to do is de-static yourself, guys. So, like, be holding a piece of metal or whatever. And what you're going to want to do is the two slots on either side of the RAM, what you're going to want to do is press them at the same time and the RAM module should pop up. So, I'm going to take this one out. So, make sure you de-static yourself. Go down here. Same time. Bang. RAM module pops straight up. Okay? So, I'll probably end up taking all of these out because... So, I'll just set these aside. Right now, I'll just take them all out. Um, let's open them all up as well. One. Also, they're a little bit dusty, so... Take them out. That one actually flew up. <laughs> okay, so these are the three. Alright, so this is the one that I bought. As you can see, they're exactly the same. Okay, which is very good. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to place them all back in. So these are the three that I bought. No, these are the three that I had. These two are the ones that I bought. Okay, so my brother's just going to show us putting them back in. Okay, so what you're going to want to do is if you come over here and I put the flash on. And you can see how in there, there's a bit of a gap, so one side's longer than the other. Same thing with the RAM. So what you can do is you're going to line that up and you're going to put it, put it straight in. So if my brother just records me, it'll be great. Yep. So come, stand up. <laughs> right. So let's put the flash on. Okay, right there. So I'm going to put it in like this. Put it in, put it in, put it in, put it in. Okay, so make sure you line it up correctly fuck fuck line it up correctly so it just slots in and then what you're going to do is push equally on the same both sides clips in perfect do the same for here actually I'll grab another RAM module for here grab this one 
Line it up. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Goes in and. So is the same. Clips in. This one goes in. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Perfect. In. Last one. Grab this. Perfect. Oh, fuck. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Push. Perfect. In. And that is how you install quad channel memory. Okay? So, yeah, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And as you can see, it's very, very dusty. But anyway, thank you for watching. Rate, comment, and subscribe. And please stay tuned for more videos. See ya.